All right, uh, so these are the live visuals uh, that we are getting uh, from Parliament. As you can see, the procedure is on for the filing of nomination papers. Remember, today is the last date uh, for filing of uh, nomination uh, papers for the vice president elections. And uh, NDA's uh, vice presidential nominee, Mr. Venkaya Naidu, as you can see, he is uh, filing his uh, nomination papers in the presence of other BJP leaders, as well as uh, Prime Minister Narendra Modi, Murli Manohar Joshi, Union Minister Sushma Swaraj, BJP President Amit Shah, and senior BJP leader LK Advani. So this is the latest uh, that we are getting uh, from Parliament. Remember, Mr. Naidu was named by the BJP as uh, the ruling alliance candidate on Monday evening. The scrutiny of nominations will now take place on 19th of uh, July. The voting will take place on the 5th of August. And the counting of votes will also be held on the same day after the voting. So after Mr. Naidu's uh, filing of uh, nomination papers, uh, the opposition candidate uh, Gopal Krishna Gandhi will also be filing his nomination papers uh, today. As far as Mr. Naidu is concerned, uh, he will go into the election now uh, with a clear advantage really over the opposition candidate Mr. Gopal Krishna Gandhi. Remember this vice president uh, of the country is elected uh, by uh, electoral college of uh, 790 parliamentarians from both the houses and after his uh, nomination as uh, the vice presidential candidate uh, yesterday evening mr naidu resigned from uh, the urban development housing and poverty elevation and information and broadcasting ministries in the union government remember he will also have to resign from the upper house to run for the post of a vice president. So, as you can see, there are two sets of nomination uh, papers that are being submitted uh, in the support uh, of uh, Mr. Naidu. It is the last day of nomination today. Prime Minister Narendra Modi, Union Minister Sushma Swaraj, as well as uh, senior BJP leaders are there flanking Mr. Naidu. They are proposing Mr. Naidu's name for the post of the vice president of the country.
These are live visuals that we are getting from Parliament House uh, where the filing of nomination uh, for the vice presidential election is on. As you can see, NDA's uh, vice presidential nominee, Mr. Venkaya Naidu, is filing his nomination uh, papers today. Today is the last day for the filing of nomination uh, papers. Remember, Naidu was chosen as uh, the candidate on Monday evening. Well, he was elected uh, to the Rajya Sabha three times from Karnataka. by the BJP leaders as well as uh, the other leaders who are flanking him who at the Parliament House complex where he has just filed his nomination papers. Remember, today is the last day of filing of nomination papers. Mr. Naidu being uh, congratulated uh, by Mr. Adwani as well. Earlier, he was congratulated by Prime Minister Narendra Modi as well. And uh, the other Indian leaders are also there flanking him as he just filed his nomination papers a short while back. All right, uh, so uh, Mr. Naidu has uh, filed his uh, nomination papers. Remember, the scrutiny of nominations will take place on 19th of uh, July. The voting takes place on 5th of August and counting of votes will also be held on the same day after voting. Remember, this all comes uh, a day after the presidential election uh, took place uh, yesterday where close to 99% of voting was recorded. And uh, as far as vice presidential uh, poll is concerned, the voting will take place on 5th of August. Remember, the term of uh, Vice President uh, Mohammed Hamid Ansari ends on 10th of August. And on 5th of August, uh, the voting will take place as well as uh, counting of uh, votes will be 
held on the same day after the voting. Speaking about Mr. Naidu, he was uh, named as uh, the NDA's vice presidential uh, candidate after a meeting yesterday. Now, he was once an Advani protege. He had earlier vigorously backed Prime Minister Modi for the Prime Minister's post uh, before the 2014 uh, Lok Sabha elections. And after his uh, name was uh, announced uh, for the vice presidential candidate, he resigned uh, from the post of uh, Urban Development Housing and, Housing and Poverty Elevation and Information and Broadcasting Ministries in the, shop, in the Union Government. So these are the visuals uh, that uh, we just uh, saw about uh, 15 seconds back is... Uh, Mr. Venkaya Naidu filed his nomination uh, papers, being congratulated uh, by all uh, the ministers and uh, senior leaders who were present along with him. Now, two set of nomination papers were filed in a support of Mr. Naidu. Remember, it is the last day for the filing of nominations. Prime Minister Narendra Modi, External Affairs Minister Sushma Swaraj, and other senior BJP leaders, including uh, Mr. Amit Shah, Murli Manohar Choshi, and Mr. Advani, there at the ha Parliament House complex, accompanying Mr. Naidu as he filed his nomination papers today. Remember, Mr. Naidu had served as the Rural uh, Development Minister in the previous NDA government led by Mr. Atal Bihari Vajpayee. He served as uh, the BJP national president as well from July 2002 to October 2004 and that too for two consecutive terms. But uh, he had quit the post after the party's defeat in the 2004 Lok Sabha elections. He was uh, an ABVP activist as well during his younger days. And he was also arrested and jailed during the emergency period. It is uh, the last day for the filing of nominations uh, for the vice presidential elections. And in a short while from now, we'll also see the opposition candidate, uh, Mr. Gopal Krishna Gandhi, also coming and uh, filing his nomination papers in Parliament House complex today. Remember, Mr. Gandhi's candidature was endorsed by 18 uh, non-NDA parties, including uh, the JTU. Now, the scrutiny of nominations will take place on 19th, uh, that is uh, tomorrow, and uh, the voting uh, to the vice uh, presidential post will be held on 5th of August. Counting will be held on the same day, and India will get its new vice president on 5th of August. Remember the term of uh, present uh, vice president, Mr. Hamid Ansari, ends on 10th of August. So these are the live uh, visuals that we were getting uh, from a Parliament House complex. As you could see that uh, Mr. Uh, Venkaya Naidu today filed his nomination uh, papers in a short while from uh, now. The opposition candidate Gopal Krishna Gandhi will also be filing his nomination uh, papers uh, today. And uh, remember, Mr. Naidu was uh, chosen as uh, the candidate on uh, Monday. And uh, Mr. Gandhi's candidature was endorsed by 18 non-NDA parties, including the JDU. The scrutiny of nominations will take place on 19th of July and voting will take place on the 5th of August and the counting of votes will also be held on the same day after the voting. All right, uh, let's uh, go across uh, to my colleague uh, Vishal Daya who's joining us uh, live from Parliament. Uh, Vishal, uh, so the formal procedure is uh, over as far as the NDA's uh, candidate uh, Mr. Venkaya Naidu is concerned and in a short while from now we'll also see Mr. Uh, Gopal Krishna Gandhi, the opposition candidate, coming and uh, filing his nomination papers. Well, yes, uh, you're right, Ashwarya. In fact, uh, the uh, new vice president will take over on 11th of August. Uh, 
and the process for uh, uh, the uh, anointment of new vice president uh, has begun now. Uh, this will be through an election process uh, and the first nomination by the NDA candidate, uh, Mr. M. Venkaya Naidu, who was a cabinet minister till yesterday, holding two portfolios of information and broadcasting and uh, urban development, uh, has now filed his nomination papers for the post of vice president of India and all the senior uh, BJP leaders and uh, uh, you know, alliance partners of uh, the BJP in the NDA and all those parties who have supported the candidature of M. Venkaya Naidu were present uh, during the filing of this nomination. We could see uh, the Prime Minister, uh, the Finance Minister and Leader of House uh, in uh, the Upper House, uh, the External Affairs Minister, BJP senior leaders like L.K. Adwani, Mulli Manoj Joshi, as well as uh, other uh, uh, NDA allies uh, and union ministers were present in that room uh, uh, of the returning officer who happens to be the Secretary General of uh, Rajya Sabha for this election, appointed by the Election Commission. Now, the second candidate for the post of Vice President, that is the opposition's candidate, Gopal Krishna Gandhi, as you're saying, whose candidature has been supported by 18 political parties, uh, the opposition grouping will be filing his nomination papers in a short file from now. And just like uh, uh, the, uh, you know, uh, the senior leaders who are present with uh, the NDN nominee, M. Venkaya Naidu, we will also see the senior leaders of the opposition parties accompanying uh, Gopal Krishna Gandhi for this nomination uh, uh, filing uh, procedure. And once that is done, then uh, tomorrow the scrutiny of these nomination papers will take place. And after that, uh, on 5th of August will be the polling. By evening, we will have the results, and uh, 10th August is the last day for the present incumbent, uh, uh, Muhammad Hamid Ansari. So, effectively, the next president, uh, next vice president of India, will take over on 11th of August next month. All right, uh, Vishal, thank you so much uh, for all those uh, updates. So, they will keep coming uh, back to you. So, obviously, it is going to be an action back day as far as uh, parliament is concerned uh, because uh, we just saw. Uh, today is the last day for filing of nominations for the vice presidential elections and we just saw NDA's uh, vice presidential nominee Mr. Venkaya Naidu filing his nomination papers in Parliament House Complex. Remember he was chosen as uh, the candidate on Monday and uh, uh, the Parliament uh, was earlier adjourned uh, and it will resume at uh, 12 noon. Of course uh, we'll keep uh, getting you all those updates from Parliament as and when they happen. And right now, we'll take a very short break. We'll be back with more news and updates. Stay tuned.